Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Borderlands the Pre-Sequel. Last episode, we reunited Pickle with his, uh, sister Eliza. Forgot her name for a second. This episode, we have more stuff to do. It's too expensive. Nurse Nina need you for love. No, <laughs> come out wrong. Nina lonely. Need partner for love times. Nina find three... How do you say? Suitors. Suitors not know they're suitors yet. Take flowers, take love card from table. Nina send you coordinates, yes? You find suitor number one. Gotta find some suitors. I see the light there. Ahem, I am Sir Hamelock, a zoologist on Pandora. There are some fascinating creatures on the moon, but one in particular strikes my fancy. Since I'm not much for interplanetary travel, could you acquire a couple of specimens and mail them to me? Now, I might mention that exporting lunar wildlife is highly illegal and more importantly frowned upon by polite society. You may have to smuggle the creatures off the moon, hope that isn't too much of a problem. It is none of my business. Very well then. The creatures I have in mind are called moon threshers. Never been heard of or seen before. Breed like wildfire, apparently. Could be strange evolutions of carnivorous plants. There's something you can do for me. I picked up an old distress signal in the Outlands. Someone might need help, but maybe there's bonds of salvage out there instead. Uploading the coords to your echo device now. Bet I'm not the only one hearing beacons. With all the ships that rained out the skies during the Krakening, well, there was a lot of distress and not much relief. If other parties think there's salvage in the offing, they'll be dipping their snouts into the trough too. Pickly dickly dock. The vault hunter ran and shot. They shot and ran and killed a man. Pickly dickly dock. It's a fine day. Full of opportunity. Lovely. Come back any day. Hmm. Guns, guns, guns! Your cash ain't worth a thing if you don't spend it. You buy from Nina, yes? Come again! Oh, Triton Flats. Guns, glorious guns. On the moon and you want to zoom? You know where you need to be. Yeah! <laughs> And that's how you make an expert landing. It nice and fast. Give chocolates and flowers. What do you want, Vault Hunter? Nurse Nina wanted me to give these to you. Little Nurse Nina? Why, I had no idea. Am I blushing? I'm blushing, aren't I? Tell Nina I'll look her up the next time I'm in town. Now you kill him with ice. See how hot his love run. What? What if I kill Bert? It's shame. He pretty boy, but too weak. Nina forgot to say, you test shooters too, yes? They tough enough to handle Nina's love, they survive. Now go find shooter number two. Don't forget card and flowers. Sure. Outlands Canyon is next. Oh, hell.
go, 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 go. Killed somebody, okay. Now I need to get to the top of this tower again. You can always trust the gun at your side. Impressive. I don't know why I reloaded. I had 88 rounds in the fucking clip. Or mag. I had an enemy frozen, corroded, ignited, and shocked at the same time. Forgot about that achievement. Let's get shot. Thanks for the SMG ammo. Oh man, someone already looted that shit. Hey, Wally, how's it going? So well, huh? Anybody else? Warning, incoming battle. Three yeah, here we go. Dark siders. You guys suck. Aren't you guys supposed to be some local gang or some shit? Pussy ass gang, if you ask me. Greetings, adventurer. I, Cosmo Wishbone, polymath extraordinaire, require your brutish assistance. I intend to bless this moon with music of my own composition. To do so on the grand scale, I shall send a satellite into orbit. To these ends, I have built a rocket. Almost. Help me complete it and you will become part of my story. Interested? To complete the rocket, I require several key items and will reward you handsomely for their procurement. First, go forth and fetch me a flow regulator. I have provided your echo device with the location of just such an item. A flow regulator will help control Excelsior's throttle. And apologies about the noisy neighbors. I could have done this myself, of course. I'm known to be a highly proficient warrior with a gun. But I'm in the middle of applying the finishing touches to my latest exploration into sound. In A minor. And it needs to be ready in time for the satellite launch. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Where are you wanting us to go? Outland Spur. Warning, no atmosphere detected. <gasps> Let's see. Oh, 
Okay. Moving slow. I heard that. Obviously, we have things to do in the canyon and the spur. However, I'm going to the spur first. Want to stop Rathus from spawning? Sure. It's a fine day. Full of opportunity. So we need the flow regulator. The atmosphere around here is I hit the wrong right. button. Well, these guys aren't getting any upgrades anytime soon. How unfortunate. We get a meager XP. But hey, I guess XP is XP. As long as it's not like one. Gone pebbles. You on up. Oh look, avalanche. <laughs> Sometimes dragons get excessive. Eight tokens. Damage. Chance. Fire rate. Recoil reduction. Crit. Recoil. Grenade. Health. Let's 
That's where I thought it was, okay. And we got this thing again. Stones. Oh wait, one moonstone. One moonstone's better than no moonstones. Just gonna pop this guy. Too soon. Please excuse me while I spend four hundred thousand dollars on the SMG rounds. Let's see if we can get some freebies. Let's just get this out of the way. Yes, most of my merchandise was ripped from the hands of dead adventurers. Okay, yeah, I got it. Sure. Uh, So that's taking us to the spur still. Where in the spur? All the way over there. Tony Slows has been boasting about having the Drakensberg's black box on the Echo Net bulletin boards for weeks. Ninkum poop that he is, it sounds like he might actually have it. So basically, I should have done this one first, then did this part. Oh well. Let's see. We gotta go so far this way, okay. There should be a cave right down the street. The proverbial street, I guess that's the way you want to say that. 
theoretical street, the imaginary street. Could just say over yonder. There is a cave over yonder. How about that? Oh no, I'm almost out of air. What will I do? Anybody else? Apparently so. Got enough for everyone. Oh, hey, Moonstone. And hey, we're back up to 31 Moonstones. Oh, there's some baddies over here we need to kill. Oi, Vault Hunter. That loot's ours. Take him, boys. What did I tell you about those snouts? Yeah, it didn't work. There we go. So there should be some kragens around here. The signal's coming from whatever remains of that structure up there. Now that we have effectively killed dozens of these guys, give me freaking money. I uh, believe we go. Oh wait, 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 wait. Boom stone. Cash. I do believe the correct way to go is this way. Yes. Wow! This place got ripped a new skylight, eh? They won't be getting their deposit back. Shh! Stay quiet. Try not to make too much noise. Got my signal, eh? Good. I've been chased here by a gang of scabs led by some gearhead named Boomer. They want my head on a stick for stealing their ill-gotten loot. I hold up here to make a stand and then realize there are too many to... <laughs> here they come. Head down there, help me fight them off. I'll drop as many as I can from up here. Yeah, come and get some, Boomer. <laughs> Okie dokie, Boomer. Stolen get tighter. Reload while I'm waiting ten years and then pop up at the cliff. Seriously. We become fast friends with Amelia's the name. Adventuring's my game. That's on my new business card. Bit twee? I like it. But then I don't know what twee means. I'm Janie Springs. 
Do you think you'll survive this shootout? I hope so. Otherwise, I've got 300 business cards that won't ever be used. You can tell me a home version, because... Pretend I said something with you. I'll work on that. Well then, okay, Journey Springs, it's yours. Humor. I know you got your Well, little girly has herself a pet vault hunter. Think your pooch is gonna save you, princess? You stole from me, and that means the big dark for you. Good Can't night. steal from a thief, Boomer. If you want it back, come and get it. Oh, God. Oh, God. Hey, you never made it. Time I date a pilot. Right, come back up. You've earned your reward. Oh dear, everybody's dead. <gasps> Nothing so listen, since you helped me, it's only fair I split my loot with you. You want to kill or not be killed? Take your pick. <gasps> Thanks again. Well, let's see. Another one of these. What's left? Huh. I better get going before any more of those scabs catch up. Looks like you lost out this time. But thanks for the pointer. What are you talking about? I got something all right. I got Amelia's number. Nothing is never an option. Well, you know, hey, you gotta get them digits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all good. I missed. Oh, hey, Moonstone. Could I, uh, get some smig? Doo -doo -doo -doo. Where the hell am I going? Oh, right. All the way back to the beginning. Down by the bay, where the watermelon grows. I dare not go. You guys are way weaker than me now, man. <laughs> Armored outlaw. Regular outlaw. Explosives from an outlaw. Uh. 
Float! Float faster! Touch the exhibits! Ah, a visitor to view my famous collection of rare starship parts. Make a small donation and we'll get started. Oh, what a pleasant surprise. Now, let the grand tour begin. Uh, and keep your meat hunks off the exhibits or else you and I are going to fall out and that will get real ugly. This here is the escape pod ejection system from the starship Gigantic, destroyed in its maiden voyage after striking a comet. All 11,000 people on board were killed when their escape pods launched, only to all smash into each other. <laughs> that is some serious bad luck. This looks like a birdcage, right? Wrong. It's the power core regulator from the Solar Liner Crusade, which exploded in space dock when someone removed it for dusting. They tried to put it straight back in, but the Crusade was, you know, exploded. And the tour continues this way if you like to follow me. The best thing I got is this flight data recorder from the Drakensberg. She suffered a critical engine failure during the Krakening and came down not too far from here. Had to fight off a lot of competition to get it. I don't mind rolling my sleeves up when I have to. Goodness, that's actually it. The data recorder. Just take it, take it now. Hey, no handling my exhibits. You're not here for the tour at all, are you, you darn crook? This is my quest item. I am very cross now. Finally, Excelsior needs a gyroscope for stability. I'll update your Echo post haste. The local ingrates won't be too happy about you taking it, but I'm sure they can be reasoned with. Well, I didn't expect such a robust defense from Tony. Still, progress demands sacrifices of us all. <clears throat> Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. Next episode, we're going back to the Triton Flats. See you then.